we're live. I Look, mean... Zeb got some new hair. Just kidding. It's <laughs> Debbie from Debbie's Design Diary. Um, we are live at the shop. Hold hey, on, I gotta. Everybody. I don't normally do this, so how do I turn off notifications? That. All right, there hey. we go. And we're back. Hopefully Jamie we... rescued me today. I would have had to sit in the airport for six hours, and she stopped so what she was doing and came and got me. And I have been having so much fun here. This store is amazing, Jamie. I've been letting it's her like loose and reorganizing it. So I thought maybe Debbie could show you like some of the things that she likes, maybe some of the things she arranged. You can so much talk to I them love. about this display here that you just had fun yeah. with. I'm gonna poke the camera down. Okay. So. Um, and just so you guys know, you can pick up everything that you're gonna see at jrvhome.com. Mariah is on here. And she is going to be dropping links as we hold things up. But if you can't find it, and you can't find it at JRV Home, you can always email info at jamierayvintagehome.com and Caitlin will help you out. So the first thing that I noticed were these. I'm obsessed with these, these little truck ornaments. You could put these on your kitchen table or on your island and fill it with little cookies and treats or it could be a cute little gift basket Treat for the holidays. Cookies but it's also an ornament. And Jamie only had a couple out and I'm like, we need to get them all together in a basket. Well, when I ordered them, I ordered 36 and we're down to like 10. I'm They're not 9 surprised. $9.95, look oh how cute Oh my gosh, I want to take one of these home. Look at the like, little fact. Also, you could put it in, my like, fingers. if you wanted to um, like make your bathroom, like your guest bathroom all holiday-ish, you could put soap in oh, here. Oh, I never thought about that. Like you could get just a little glass liner that fits and stick You know what? We what? sell French soap. <gasps> Isn't, wouldn't that like succulents, soap, so treats? Cute. Like if you do like a little cookie mix or a little gift basket. Yes, a, a mini gift basket. I love it. So it's... Debbie showed me that it's good. I'm going to put the camera down. But Debbie showed me that it's good to group things. So yeah. you guys can see we've got a basket here with all the little trucks and then all my little gnomes that we sell are in a basket down the here. Gnomes, the gnomes are so stinking cute. You can get a set of three for $12.95 on the website. Yes. Say hello to my little friend. Three for $12.95? That's three. a good deal, Jamie. I, well, I'm a deal giver. Wow. Also, this these are we only have a few of these left. These Those are, are our, very cool. These are for your Christmas tree. Let me find the tag on here. It's thirty one ninety five, and instead of doing like a skirt. You can put one of those around there. Yes, and I love these little scoops. Okay, let's let's get up from our feet. Look at the scoops. All right, what would you... grouping is a good thing. So yes. that you can use in your. Fl I know you you're keto. Yes. So maybe you could scoop bacon. But uh, almond flour. Almond flour. She already gave me a bag of bacon for lunch. She knows what. I, I picked mean. Debbie up from the airport, and then I got some keto food from my house so she wouldn't starve. But people put that in their flour or their dog food. Yes. For scooping dog food or bird food in my case. Or I think that it would be really cute if you just put like some floral foam and then stuck a bunch oh, yeah. of like that would um, be cute. holiday, you know, berries. You can make it into an ornament greenery. too. Hey. Yes. It could totally be like you could hot glue the greenery in here and hang it from your tree. Hello. Cute. You could put a little IOD transfer on it or Situation. stencil. Stencil it. I, I think, think we're going to need to have a scoop I think we tree. got a new Christmas ornament. Yeah, those are $4.95, by the way, which I've looked at them on Amazon, and $4.95 is a really good price. So you yes. go first. Let's see if they've got any comments, questions. Um, Leslie says, or pick food. And Donna from Crescent Moon says, she just finished watching your new video, and she loves the dresser. <gasps> Donna! Donna from Crescent Moon, you're in um, Delaware, right? Mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, Donna's my jogger girl. She owns all of our joggers. Nice. All right, so we also displayed, we have a few displays of sheep. And, and these, look, oh, go ahead. So what are you supposed to put in the sheep? Because so, I have a million ideas. Can so it's supposed me? to be a planter. Do you think you oh. could fit a succulent in there? You could, you totally could. But you know what else you could do is you could, you could fill it with that, you know, that styrofoam and then put little, um, like wire with people's names. So at the holidays. A little place setting. Yes. Johnny, Susie, Jamie. Limited number, six feet apart. Yes. <laughs> so these are nine ninety five, and they're made of cement. I personally would just use them in a vignette because I just think they're cute as is. But you could yeah, also no, make totally. them extra. You could totally make them extra. All right. These are cute. I love hardware. Oh, yeah. These are the mini number hooks. Can you even get all these in there? There's so many. Oh, my goodness. I didn't even notice the numbers on them. I need to hang up. I need a better way to display them. That's your Can next you? job. 
Could you also like hang stockings from mm -hmm. these? So Look this it. is a set of cast iron hooks. They're one through six and they are $42.95 for all six oh, hooks. Oh, you get all six. And they're cast iron. I have a lot of I cast love. iron because it's I love durable. cast iron. That's I, my favorite. I like to make my steak in my cast iron pan. Okay, last of the big, remember we said these were the bougie gnomes because we have the cheap gnomes. This one is $15.95. This is the last one. Last bougie, bougie gnome. I it's love got this. sparkles. Jamie, I love it. So this. you love that camper is, cookie jar? Do you only have one of these? I think we have two left. Oh, I love it. You could also make it, I, I like to turn everything into a planter. So you can put succulents <laughs> in it and make it a centerpiece on your Do table. you actually have plants to sit on? Does it have a price tag? Oh, it's on the front. It's $44.95. Super, super cute. We have a couple of those left. Wouldn't it be right, fun let's... to make some cookies and then give it as a gift and just be like, I made you some cookies. Or I picked <laughs> these up at Whole Foods and I put them in here. Yes, that too. <laughs> hey, all kinds of cooking works. These are also cool. Those are super, super So these pretty. are called our ornaments, but they're like big fatty ones. I don't think this one has a price on it. So these are um, $9.95, but they're big. You can put them like on a wreath or hang them from yeah, the door. Yeah, like hang, hang, them, hang them in the middle of the wreath. Like yeah. you know how I like to hang stuff in the center where the hole is? That would be very, very pretty. Oh, Les wants a shout out. Hi, Les. She says, my Les two Meyer. girls are together. I love you Aww. both. We love you too, Les. I feel like I got to adopt Les because what didn't she come to you first? I think I she... found Les and I shared it with you. Yes. We all love Les. Yeah. Alright, let's see if there's anything else over here that we need to talk about. I love the Noel sign and the beautiful green dresser. Is it chippy? Gorgeous. It's Monet's garden and salty kiss. Uh, I cute. love this whole vignette. I don't know if you guys can see it, but it's yeah. so pretty. It's very Christmas. And vintage -y. Christmas. And then we've and got these silver dollar wreaths. These are actually a really good deal. I bought them on clearance. They're $26.95. They should be like 50 bucks, but they're not. I got we them on totally need to oh, that would be cute. This right here, Jamie. All right. Merchandise Look. that. Yes. Here, we'll just hang it up. Here. Debbie has been playing shop. I love that's my favorite thing to do is just to decorate the shop. And uh, well, she also has, had me like lift the tree. I think it yeah. looks better higher up. The tree was down on the floor. I'm like, you can't have a tree down. Well, we have a few of these left. These are our oh. farm animals ornament set. You get four of them for eleven ninety five. Those are so. Cute. They come gift wrapped. Wow. All right, let's go over to the towel bar. The All right, we're gonna bar. we're gonna take you to the towel bar. I didn't know you had a towel. Bar. Well, we used to have a jewelry bar. Nobody was buying the jewelry, so we converted it into. Dun, 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 a towel bar. I'm obsessed with these. The these green sack coasters. Are so cute. Have you guys seen these? So they're a set of four for $14.95. And we have like five left. We have like 20. I love them. Yeah, I love they them. They have been really so popular. Much. Did you see these? These are green sack hot pads. Oh, $21.95. These are cute. It. And you've got green sack dish towels too. We have oh we got dish towels for days. Oh my goodness. We, got, we have a few of the pumpkin pie ones left. And oh. then, look at that one, deck the hall. Can you tell I love campers? Those are so, so cute. Those These are ones good. are, so all of the kitchen towels are in flat rate shipping. These are $15.95 for four towels. Nice, and they're really good or quality. Four, three, one, two, no, four. Yeah, they're nice flower sack towels. So if you go in the towel section on the website, no matter how many towels you buy, you're going to pay $7.95 in shipping. So. Where's you can that? just buy it all up. Where's that thing that you showed me downstairs about the craft supplies? Oh, that, we'll get, that's in the other room. Oh, I love that. Debbie's obsessed with that one. All right. <laughs> Let's see. Oh, these. These oh, are yeah. amazing. These are all we have left. We've actually had these for a while. Gorgeous. These glass balls. They're mercury glass, uh, but they're like thick hand blown. So yeah. everyone is unique, handmade. You, I don't know if you can tell the quality, but these are like super thick glass. Don't you have a thing about thick glass? I like thick glass and yeah. I cannot lie. <laughs> you other can't deny that when a They're ball so walks in with something in your face, I can't sing a, the rest of the song because it's not clean. They've but. got a good weight to them. Too. Yeah, they're sturdy. Well, even the bottom, like they're just. Yeah, no. Yeah. We've Beautiful. got. This is all we have left of these mercury ornaments. And they're $10.95 for the big ones and $7.95 for the little ones. Uh, so. They're so pretty in the dough bowl, too. Yeah, and we have dough bowls for days. Yes. All right, let's move this camera around. We okay, showed them. Where are we going next? Let's the show towels. Them the vignette that we did over here. All right. Two. We'll go past the French soap. It smells good. I'll just give you a little peek at the soap situation. It Do we want so good all Debbie. the candles? There's Debbie's candles. And then we've got our Christmas scents. 
And then all the candles, all the soap, also in flat rate. So if you want to buy a candle and soap and a towel, it's not going to cost you more than $7.95 because they're in the flat rate shipping. And those, I didn't even see those. The pop shop, those are so cute. So these are vintage and we have, I think, four left and they're $4.95 each. We had a bunch. Oh, I love those. Yeah, I found those when I was out, I think, thrifting or yard selling. Look how cute Get those out. Are. If I would have found these yard selling, I would have died. I found a whole would bunch of them in a crate. That's all I have left. <gasps> The crate sold and a bunch of them sold and I have four So was left. it a, what, some kind of soda from a long yeah, this, time ago? Yeah, no, there was these places called the Pop Shop and they would bottle their sodas in these. Oh, I'm yeah. buying one of these. We need Zeb to smell them. They like when Zeb, no, not that, the oh. candles. Oh. Zeb, when we got the French soap in, Zeb smelt every Oh, I'll bar. totally smell. All I right. love smelling candles. Okay, tell okay. them that one's Christmas Day. Let's see if it smells like Christmas Day. It does. Oh, it's, that's good. Guys, right, smell that. So good. Where is Zeb? Zeb's putting plumbing in at the farmhouse. It smells like greenery and cinnamon and the fireplace going and pajamas. Now, this is keto friendly, this gingerbread candle. Gin homemade gingerbread. Instead of Zebby, we have Debbie. Get it? Zebby, oh, Debbie. Oh, that's really good. It, it smells like a gingerbread latte, like it has a milky. No, oh, like, I don't think I've smelled that latte one. Latte smell too. It's not oh, just it gingerbread. It's, it definitely smells vanilla gingerbread. -y. Well, and we have the melts in all of our antique candle company scents. So if you want to just buy the melts, we've got these too. And I'm trying to convince cool. Debbie to make melts with her candles. Well, I didn't know they could be packaged so pretty. Yeah. I always thought of melts as totally no. different than that. These, you know why these sell well? Because I sell a lot online. So they buy this first, get a little bit of crack. And then they buy the whole candle. Well, how do melts actually work? Because I've never even used a melt. You just put so. them into the little melt thing. Like there's this little thing you plug in and it melts it just like a candle. So it smells like a candle burning, only there's no fire. So it's less of a hazard? Mm -hmm. like you Unless your kids. kids dump over it and then there's wax all over your house. Ask me how I know. Oh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get one of these from you and then yeah, take I, it back to Yeah, Reverse LA. engineer this because okay. I need these in yours because I know I'd sell more candles if people could buy the melts first. Good tidings. Oh, that has a really clean smell. That's the one we're burning today. I like that. Yeah, we have almost sold out of the Christmas day because we were burning them. And these are our fall scents. So we have apple cider, country pear, and pecan pie. Okay, where's the pecan pie? This oh, one right here. Oh, oh, oh. Yes, I love anything that smells of sugar. This is good. It has like a burnt sugar, caramelized brown sugar, Yumminess. Yeah, that's Deb's favorite pie, by the way, pecan pies. Yeah, yeah. I do make him a pecan pie. You so. could totally make a keto pecan pie. Did you, you know try that? some of the stuff that I gave you when I got your gift basket? Have you used any of the bath stuff, Debbie? Jamie, I barely have taken a bath since you I, gave that to I me. heard that you haven't been showering. <laughs> I gave Debbie a bunch of bath stuff at her grand opening, hoping she'd use it. All right, so we've redone this display here. We've got all of our glass. Remember last week we showed you these copper topped jars? So Gorgeous. these are the diamond canisters and I then we've got the rose gold snap top lids this one is 1095 this is the hermetic jar with the, the classy like if you want to make bougie jam use wow. the rose gold. i know those are so we pretty. try to be fancy around here all right i love just a little greenery here and there like you could take this greenery and then put we just left the price tags here we didn't Oops. get it we were busy she was like making me I, I wanted to keep decorating and she's like two minutes Debbie but look you could just sit a little ornament oh, on top cute. of the greenery on your like just decorating here and there on your fireplace mantle and whatnot I, I just feel like the greenery adds so much texture and it's such a simple thing to do well these are supposed your... to go around candles but I just think they're like but cute no, little mini could do any, you could put a mason jar on top with That'd a candle cute. inside or it could go on top of a candle these would be cute if you have a flocked like Christmas this. tree as ornaments, because on the white Christmas tree. Oh, yeah, yeah. So these are $4.95. These are the dill wreaths. So they're priced really well. At $4.95, you definitely could buy a bunch of them. For, they don't smell like dill, though. They don't. Well, thank goodness. Who wants to be like, oh, is it Christmas or pickles? <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm going to show this display over here, because Debbie redid this, and you can tell them what you did over here. Tell them what you did, okay. Debbie. So can I they see it? To, like, I just love to put, like like colors together and create like a little i call it like a color story so i love the sparkly silver wreath with the mirrors behind it i just think that's so christmasy and snowy looking and fresh and then 
I like to put little details in. So I put all the big pieces on first. Like, so if you're decorating for your home, you start with the big stuff and you, you kind of establish it and get balance. And then you keep adding in until you get down to the teeny tiny little details. And like these would be so pretty if you have a mirror in your home. And you just <laughs> Can wanna, you get it out? Oops. You just want to drape it across the mirror with a little bit of greenery and that just totally like just a few touches will just totally Christmas up your home. So well, and I like these because if you want a neutral farmhouse Christmas, they're yes. not like in your face Christmas. Yeah, because Christmas doesn't necessarily always have to be Christmas, you know, no. it can be a myriad of different things. Totally. And these are, are cute. Just gorgeous. All right. I'm going to actually show them from a different angle because I feel like this one shows better this way. Okay. All right, guys, sorry, hopefully I'm not making you sick. See how pretty that display is that Zebby, yeah. Debbie, I called you Zebby. Zebby. Debbie made. I'll take it. I'll be called Zebby. All right, I, I do want to show you this. Remember that thrift haul a while back? There was that black pot. I told you a magic eraser would clean it up. This enamel pot is $19.95 on the website, and it got all kinds of cleaned up. This would be so cute with a Christmas tree in it. Totally with the Christmas Very tree. Very French country. Well, you've got these little mini Christmas trees over here. Oh, you totally could put those in there. Where did they go? We'll have to, that's around the corner. We'll show them. All right. Okay, Jamie, I have a bunch of these that I got in France mm -hmm. when we went last year. I ordered some glass glitter. And wouldn't Could that be cool? Glitter, the you, antique keys? You Mod Podge it. First but they're thing. antique. I know, but if you hung them on your Christmas tree, like you could hang them just, they're beautiful like this. But I, I think they would like, be Like, really this is original pretty. rust. I know. Well, you could dip them. Like, half of them could be glitter. So you don't have to go to France for the low, low price of $5.95. Oh, man. In France, these were like $14 each. I know. Everything's more expensive in France. Yeah. But if you want some of these antique... Oh, they're $5 each. Look at that. Even better. Oh, no. Those are the other antique keys, I think. Yeah, these are these ones. So they have these ones that are not rusty or 5 I love these. these. I would love to just do a whole tree with these rustic little shoe molds shoes. and the keys and some greenery. You could just do like a very simple farmhouse tree. With yeah, these, these are really cute. I don't know how many of these we have left. These are eleven ninety five for these little I got them antique shoes. Right here, they're like there's like six or seven of them. Oh, they're very yeah. very cute. Very very. Oh, pretty. this is new. This has been oh oh that's it, it has a magnet. So this has been out of stock. This oh, you, here you get common. <laughs> Let me see. So you guys, this has been out of stock. I haven't been able to get them in. It's the rooster string and it comes with a scissors for $29.95. You get these cute little scissors. So if you want to use this for like wrapping your Christmas presents ah, or whatever, that your little wrapping adorable. station. Or like on your craft table. Like when you're, oh, yeah, crafting, when you're crafting, you need twine to make to hang up your ornaments, and you could like when you run out of this, you could put baker's twine on it. Or yeah, there, yeah. well, and we have we don't have any out, but on the website we have this cute little pom pom garland. <gasps> That'd be so cute, something like that on here too. So uh, this is twenty nine ninety five. I think we have one or two. So if you've I'm been wanting gonna, one of these, I brought a suitcase that could be emptied out very. So easy. I haven't even shown you the pom pom. <laughs> Friend, she's a she's a nut. There's pom poms pom -poms here. There's pom poms. Oh my goodness! Here, but we have them. Debbie's like, let me see what they say. I know. <laughs> it's too small for me. Okay. Um, what? I was going to ask. Elaine says she needs another stimulus check. <laughs> I get that. All oh, right. I didn't even notice these. These are so cute. I keep telling Jamie that she has to bring the little things up to eye level because you miss them. Look at these. These would be so cute on your tree, too. Like, well, they're I, actually, I think they're listed as ornaments. They are. Ugh. We got to put some of these over on the okay, tree. Okay, we'll put them on the tree. All right, let's There's see. pigs and cows. Yeah. What's the price of these? These are, this is not the correct price tag. Look, and then they're One so the cute in the middle of a wreath. You just take an ornament and you put it on your wreath. And look at that. It's just. That's way cute. The little way cute. cow on this. Okay. Hold on. Wait. I got it closer. $5.95. $5.95? That's it? Debbie, I, you that know. That is so good. I, I would sell that in my store for like 14 Well, you know. <laughs> They're like enamel. But this one says it's $22. It was priced wrong. I think it's something else. All right, you want this on the tree? Yes. All right, we'll show you the pig on yeah. the tree. Oh, somebody bought something. What did they buy? Oh, the rooster string with the scissors. Of so course. how many do we have left now? That's amazing. Oh, that was the last one. Good thing you bought it. Whoop, whoop. All right, I'm gonna this, show you. Oh. Look at this sign. You're keto, you need this sign. More milk, please. Can I, I drink I mean, that's milk. so me. Yes. 
I'm in France kids. trying to get milk. Yes. And they bring me it out in a little pitcher. And I'm like trying to drink it. And they're like, oh, don't drink out of the pitcher. So they bring, they brought me a wine glass for my milk. And the same with water. They never brought us I know. Water. I was so thirsty in France. I was super thirsty too. We need to hang this up. Okay. All right, hold on. Before we move on, this is $34.95. Yeah, this needs to be like up there or over the door. Like this All right. is cool. We'll hang that up when we're no longer live. There's so much stuff in here, Jamie, that I feel like needs needs to be more prominent. Did you see this French pillow? Look at that one. I got, just got those in. I think we have one or two left. These are twenty seven ninety five with the insert. I love that it's vertical. I know. You never it's see fun. pillows like this, and like I feel like they're always the same shape, so this adds like a little, little interest, a little twist. It's a little bougie. I'm wearing. Do you guys notice that I'm wearing a new boot jacket? We'll show yeah. you these in a little bit. So Ooh. we. I know it's furry, right? It's fake fur. They had to give me a pat down at the airport and they used they the back of their hands. They would have loved patting you down <laughs> in this. I know. Yeah. It's ooh. supposed to look like rabbit fur, but it's not. It's faux. I it's don't know. Cute. Which tag is this? Is this my jacket or the shirt? Um, this is your shirt. Let me oh, see. Let okay. me find the jacket. I think, well, the jacket I've had for a while, so I'll um, tag. I'll tell you guys the price on this jacket in a little bit. We did get new shirts. So this is the Mary Graphic Tee. I like to leave Very the tags on so when I'm live, I can just... Shop well, time. I just do that at my shop because I don't know. I like to wear, audition it for like an hour. Be to, before you commit? Yeah, before I commit. Mm -hmm. So then people are getting stuff that maybe Debbie wore? <laughs> well, I quarantine it so they don't get my... Well, I mean, maybe either. that's better. Under my arm? Is there a price tag under my arm? No. No. But I do... Oh, yeah. Okay. But it doesn't say how much oh, it is. It, all right. This one hasn't been tagged. We'll show you in a little bit. So this is a new graphic tee. Remember we had these in red and now we have them in I love burgundy. This. Yeah, that's like a mulberry. Okay. Yeah, $26.95. And we have some other graphic tees we'll show you in a little bit. All right, let's show them the cement display. Okay. Rana, can you move that without I think so. hitting anything? I just hope I don't make everyone seasick. All right. Okay. Okay. <gasps> cement pears. Cement pears for days. for days. You guys, these pears are $4.95. So Jamie, Jamie has a whole basement full of candy store goodness. I went down there. I'm like, Jamie, why do you just have one pair up here? You need to bring all the pears up and make a pear, a partridge in a pear tree. A partridge in a pear tree or a French millinery pear tree because it's painted in French millinery oh, yes. with white wax. Yes, I love these pears. Yeah, pears are all the rage right now in farmhouse decorating, but they're really hard to find. And they're really great for the holidays because oh, pears are good. And you could stencil the pears. Could Why you? do you want to keep painting my stuff? <laughs> it's just, <laughs> just as good the way that it is. I can't, I can't help it. I like to embellish. Debbie wants to make everything fancy. I do. All right, let's show them these jars. Cute. We showed you guys these last week. These are the Italian glass jars. Nice thick bottom, ten ninety five, and they've got the cute white lids. Don't stencil them. Don't. Because... Yeah, don't stencil the jars. <laughs> But you could put a little sprig of greenery in here. You could judge it up or mm -hmm. just buy three and display them on a shelf. That's yeah. what I would do. I think things are good with greenery. Um, yeah. Day do picks. We got Two. these for days. They're three ninety five a pick. They have a little bird nest in them. You know what I like to do is like on my Christmas tree, I like to stick them into the branches and like they add more texture and then you could get a little glittery bird and stick it oh, in there. Oh, that would be cute. So if you guys and want these you, for your Christmas tree, I put, never even thought about putting my Christmas tree. Oh, totally. You put them in your Christmas tree and then you put in the bird and you take a bird cage and you put it at the top of the tree and you have a whole aviary. Bird, put a theme. bird on it. Yes. I love it. Yes. Don't, don't knock them out. All right, speaking of knocking out, we have three of these artichokes left. They're $24.95. We had six, we sold half of them last week gorgeous aren't they amazing yes. they look like um weathered wood with white wax they do yeah they totally do. they've already been they've already been weathered wooded we have the cement pumpkins too oh yeah let's talk about the pumpkins look at how cute we have them displayed over here like look at this situation we've got right. this big chunky can they see no, can you just see? see there we go sub's so much better with the a camera big chunky. what do you call this Oh, super chat from Yumiko. Yumiko, I know Yumiko. Hey, yeah. Yumiko. She said, Debbie, nice to see you at Jamie's. What I, size? I, uh, oh, I'm wearing a medium jacket, Ivana. I wear a medium in this and the other furry coat that we have. So what what do you call this? Is it just an architectural So this is chunk? a column base. Oh, okay. And I think they're $74.95. So they're actually antique. This is like the original paint. They kind of distress it off. I love that. And then we just took one of Jamie's little cotton wreaths. Also for sale at jrbhome.com. And then we put the pumpkin on, and it's like 
boom, 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 you've Look, got a beautiful done. centerpiece. Display finished. All right, yes. so these are $14.95 for the cream and the gray, and we just have a few left in each color. Oh, another super chat from Andrea. Thank you. That's oh, the so column nice. bases are $79.95. I misspoke. That gorgeous. The gorgeous, gorgeous. All right, let's show them this gorgeous display that Debbie worked on over here. Hold on. I'm going to go. Sorry, guys. Oh, yeah. About this we got you know we've got all the amazing aprons on the website and then remember last week we showed you the chunky knit pillows that I are love $48.95 we've got a few of the Christmas begins with Christ pillows these are $24.95 and they're a smoke uh, and deal I think there's a wow two left. $24 are such good quality. I got them on clearance Debbie they're so thick like, I that know it's like a and $70 pillow where are you shopping oh you shop at anthropology I'm like where are you shopping <laughs> $70 pillow we shop in two very no. different stores yeah, all the pillows I buy cost $70. Oh, so you won't balk at the $48.95 for the chunky no, knit? No, no. I'm used to paying that for pillows. How much do you think this play? How much does Debbie think this pillow cost? I would say that's at least $45. Nope, it's down filled $39.95. Get out. Yep, down insert. Boom. No way. Yep. Oh, my god. I'm a really good shopper, You guys are Debbie. giving the stuff away. I'm giving away the farm. Yeah. yeah, if you guys need pillows, apparently you should buy them from me because they're a good deal. Oh, they are a good deal. Oh, did you see these? Seven I made. I saw you guys making with the leather straps. I love it. I saw this for like $80 at Williams Sonoma. Yeah. You can buy yeah. this. And I finished the bottom less. Are you so oh, proud of me? And you could take, like, you could put this on your farm table and take three of the cement pumpkins. Boom, boom, boom. Or what about the, the cement pears? Oh, the pears, yes. With a little bit of greenery. Yeah, picture this. I just want, I just Wait, want And this go. is all food safe, so you could put, like, grapes or whatever, make a very um, luscious display. You could do a charcuterie board. Yeah, is that how you say it? Charcuterie? I don't know. I, I can't. It's just meat and cheese. We just call them cooteries, for short. <laughs> cooteries. cooteries. All right, hold on. How much is this one? This one is $42.95, and we only have one of these because it's handmade by Zeb. We have another, let me show you the other tree. Did you see the other tree? Oh, Debbie, show them this pillow. I made that. Yeah, you made this? Yeah, I did. Oh, Jamie. I made stuff. Look, she did stencil something. I was just trying to talk about how good the stencils are on everything. Yeah, I stenciled and that pillow. Let's see, what does she have on this? You're giving this away. What? $26. It's and it way. comes with a down insert. How are you doing this? Well, I got the insert and the pillowcase from Ikea, okay. and I stenciled it. Okay. The low, low price of twenty six ninety five. We only have one of these, by the way, because I made this. Uh, what was I doing? I think this was on a channel member video. Wow. Love Debbie, but she's talking California prices. <laughs> well, I pay California rent. Yeah, <laughs> that girl pays California. You don't even want to know what she, she pays. No, like and 10 everyone times. comes into my store and says how affordable my prices well, are. It's because everybody's from California, so we did this one too. Uh, and this has, we ha we sell these couples. Is this one of your stencils? Uh-huh. This is one of our th Thanksgiving ones from last year. It has, like, more to it. Oh, and do you sell these? Mm -hmm. Yeah. I love those. These are three ninety five each, and they're cast iron. Three ninety five. You know what? You could put, like, the shipwrecked wax on here. Why are you waxing all my stuff? <laughs> all right. So this is another one, food, totally food safe, and a thirty nine ninety five for this That one. is just crazy. That's a crazy price. Well, I got a the $79 item. I got the wood from the tip. Do you know what the tip is? No. It's the dump. No way. That's what they call it in the UK. Ah, it's fancy. It's fancy. It's fancy. Debbie needs to shop at Jamie's. Yeah, she's going to shop here and then take it up. I'm going to take it to my store and mark it up. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I think we no, Oh, you want to talk about oh, these stars? What about this little vignette? Oh, this vignette's so cute. We're going to be the all day in here. Mantle. We did the fireplace. Yeah, we did the fireplace mantle. All right, so you guys know I'm obsessed with the enamel. I love the aqua enamel. It was all on the floor, tucked under something. You couldn't even see it. And Jamie gave me one of these as a gift for my grand opening. I am obsessed with it. And I was like, I wonder what Have you used the has. bowl? You haven't used the bath products, but have you used the bowl? Well, all of the stuff you gave me is still, still in the bowl. <laughs> because, Jamie, I don't have a life right now. Opening a store takes a lot. You know. I don't know. Like, I have you used your bowls at home? For anything? Have you decorated your house yet? For decorate for what? There's, for life? Apparently, there's a couple holidays coming up. I decorate the shop. <laughs> that this is it. Same. I tell my kids, you want to feel Christmassy? Come to the shop. That's my life too. My house come to is, the shop. My house is a staging area. What is less? You girls should switch places for a week and see how it goes. That's, That'd be hilarious. Yeah, I'd come back to my store and there would just be gray and white everywhere. There <laughs> is lots of color in here. I'll have you know. 
It's all tucked under. I brought the color out for you guys. So I took all of her aqua enamel and I put it together with these cute little tabletop trees. How cute are these? What were we saying would be cute with these? Oh, if you put a bunch of those in that enamel bucket. Yes. So I love these. They're just simple little, and you can pull you get, out. The, you zhuzh them up. You, you make them look them fatter. Out. I don't know why fatter trees are better, but they are. I love these little, like they're, they it's remind me It's 12 dollars for that. That is a bargain. I can tell you right now that I have something similar in my store. It's a little bit bigger, but it's um $30. It's a little it's okay. chunkier. We still love you. I, I just mark them up to what, according to what I pay. A port, a, I guess you're shopping at better places than Well, I normally shop at DI, so. I don't know that these, I, I want to fluff all of these now. Okay, you can fluff all the trees. I but just look some... how cute it oh, is. Oh, Martha got three pairs and one and of the sheep. Good job, Martha. enamel pot. Oh, that's cute. Hello? So that's cute. That's way cute. Okay, how much is the pot? Did I price it? Hold on. The pot is $18.95. Bargain. Bargain basement prices, apparently. And Do you guys... I also, I don't know if you guys noticed, but I put one of these, you can't really see it, but she has these beautiful candlesticks and you just take the little tree and you put it on the stick. And done. And boom. Okay, do you, Debbie, you're going to die. Okay, how much do you think the set of three candlesticks is? If they were in my store, I would sell them probably for $60 for the set of three. $26.95 for the set wrong. of three. That's I got them wrong. for free. How do you expect me to stay in business? Well, you should get stuff for free. <laughs> $26.95. So this is a set of three. But and somebody I had to paint them. I painted them in like, that's this, old, this DIY paint. No time. All right. $26.95 for a set of three. I think these are still in the Saturday thrift haul, but I'm not sure. We, if you search square pedestal candlestick set. Can we talk about the piglets? They're cute. And the, more sheep. I got. I asked her to bring up all the sheep from the basement so I could cluster them together. They do look really cute like I that. I like them in... I like it. I, Martha Stewart taught me that. Oh, I love like the Martha. Back in the day when Martha was everything, she said... Martha taught she, me how to she cook. She used to speak like in French terms and she said, you want to display things in mass. Like, but she pronounced it en masse. En masse. And that means to create groupings of several together. It creates an impact. I'm gonna so take all this information that you're giving me back to my business coaching. I told them you were coming and you were gonna help me and they're like, oh, I wanna see your store after Debbie's yeah. done. So another thing that I did for Jamie is I created height because she's got a, a small, how many square feet do you have? Um, display wise, maybe a thousand. A thousand square feet. My store in Solana Beach, 720 total square feet including the back room five yes 550 display wise and so i was there for 20 years and i learned how to maximize space and one of the things by. that jamie needed was height so i took her crates that were on the floor and i created height and put things on top of each other and group them by color because when you have a lot of stuff in a little space so if you have a small home or if you have a booth you want to make it pleasing for the eye. You can cram a whole bunch of stuff into your store, but when you put it by color, it's not as scattered and the customer doesn't have to work as hard to find what they're looking for. No, I so, like it. Yeah, it actually so, looks more when you do it like this, like how my home looks. Like right. My home is very like organized. And yeah, not and you want, you want people to see it in their homes when they walk in and this way they can picture it. And the next thing that we're going to get to, because I'm going to be here on Saturday, is her clothing room. We're going to do all of that by color and size as well. Because when you walk in there, it's really overwhelming because you have so many cool things. I, I'm, I'm a good shopper. All right, I want to show you guys this piece. <laughs> so this was done with our, oh, you're standing oh. right. This was done oh. on a live video. This was a Waste Not Wednesday. It was given to us for free. It was missing it back. And we use the window maker Yay. with the wreath maker, yeah. and these are the corbel stencils. Look how that cute that turned out. only $124. I got the piece for free. It would be $250 if I made it. Well, you're That's, better than I am. No, I just have higher rent or something. I don't know. Utah is different. Utah's um, the bomb. But wow, it's gorgeous. And I, I it used sell to be a these, radio cabinet. I also sell Jamie Ray stencils, but I haven't had time to get Isn't this one the cool? Window. Yeah. And you can make and, all you can uh, make bigger windows because you can I love build how them. you did the, you know, I saw the corbel stencil and I'm like, I don't know what to do with these, but duh. I've been building a farmhouse. I haven't had much time to play, but these are really and the fun wreath, stencils. Like I'm gonna do I'm gonna steal this idea. You can steal it. You can it's not stealing. I did it on Waste Not Wednesday. But I'm I'm copying it, just so you know. So you can pick up the stencils and the DIY paint on our DIY website, which is jamierayvintage.com. 
We have two websites because we have thousands and thousands of items, so I had to separate them because I have two teams of shippers. All right, let's show the cute, oh gosh, fireplace. Sorry if I'm making you sick. Zeb is so much better at this. So Jamie just had one of these out, and I saw a bunch in the basement, and I liked it. Like, don't you like it the way it looks like? No, I do, because then somebody can come grab one. Yeah, and um, your display is still there, and it just, I don't know, it tells a story. And here's another one of these cute little trucks that I adore. And I love what you did with these. Did you make these in a Waste Not Wednesday? I did make those in a Waste Not Wednesday uh, with the ribbon you got me when you came to my grand opening. Yes. And dollar store stuff. The little, the little cake pans. The little bump. Adorable. It's this, the bump. This would be cute on the top of a tree as a tree topper or just hanging this way on your door. So let's tree. see what's the price on these ones. These are $22.95. So cute. I and love those. We also sell these corbels as a set. They're $204 for these corbels. They're really great on a mantle. Yeah. And then we also have this Christmas watercolor. I'm not positive, but I think this watercolor is like $24 or $26. Because I got it on clearance. Debbie, I got it on clearance. I, apparently She's shaking her head at me. In the clearance situation. Okay, so do you know what my secret is when I'm wholesale shopping? What? Okay, you guys, if you guys have a store, I'm going to share a little secret with you. I'm going to When you get go to the website, yeah. you search low to high. Uh, and then you see all the cheap stuff first. And then you can look at the good, the, the higher price stuff later. I usually search high to low. <laughs> I do. I do because, like, a lot. well, for clothing, I do. You know why? See, because I like 100% cotton things. and those You know what 100% usually... cotton means? What? You gotta bust out the iron. <laughs> but ain't nobody like, got time to iron cotton, stuff. And I, it's, it's good, but I, that's how I do it. I wanna show them those bird cages. This is the that's last set. So this is a clearance item too. Now these are kind of spendy. Oh, I would glass glitter these and put a nativity scene. She wants scene. to glitter all my shiz. Put bring, a nativity bring the, scene inside. Bring me the bird cages. All right, how so. Cute. If you just opened up the, is there like a door? Yeah, so the top opens. Jamie, you need, do you have a nativity scene? Yeah, I do. I got a Put paint. it in there. Wouldn't okay, that be cute? $124.95 for two of these ginormous brass planters. They would normally be like 200 but again, this is something I got on clearance. Yeah, see, and if I had time, I would put a, a hook in the ceiling. You hang that. And hang these and put your nativity scene. Well, I have in. a nativity. Maybe we'll paint that and you Maybe can put it in Saturday. Maybe we can do Saturday. this. Yeah, on the Saturday. Can I be in the live with you on Saturday? You and Kenise are both going to be on Saturday night um, Do you guys want me to do that? <laughs> we're not doing that. we got new stuff. I'll bring the nativity and you can paint it while we're doing the live. Please just keep moving around here. If you, it's like it's over and you got to move on to the next thing. But I, want, I totally want to do that. I think they want me to. We'll All right, let's see. Ain't got time for high prices. <laughs> Hi, Mariah. Mariah just linked all the corbels. Debbie, where'd you get your shoes? Do you sell those? No, I wish I did. These but are... my shoes are from here. She, I had on, I had on some little sneakers, and she's like, "I'm gonna change my shoes." I'm like, "Do people see your shoes?" They do sometimes see my shoes, and I had my farmhouse, the shoes I wear at the farmhouse. They have like, uh, what's that called? Insulation on them. Okay, you want to talk about this display? Okay, so this we're still working on, but I saw these down in Jamie's basement and there wasn't a single one of them up here. And I am obsessed with these. This would be so pretty at the top of your tree. So you know what these are made with? What? They're made with old tobacco basket or tobacco lap. Uh, they're gorgeous. You could put it on your front door. You could put it at the top of your tree. $11.95. You put it in your fire what what i should probably raise the prices on those um a lot yeah of shit. you guys better buy them fast could you guys if you buy them could you buy like three she's got so. a bunch and i'm gonna bring up more i want to do like a whole vignette with these stars i'm just getting started but here's like here's another thing show them the doormat display jamie what? okay i show. have a, I, I have a doormat display apparently she doesn't love it because this is what i was telling her when you have a store or a booth you have to think of it like real estate. And so every square foot is money. But how do you and display doormats? Not like that. I was like, I'll just hang them on the wall and no. then people can see them. No. Nobody's bought it. Eye level is like the most pricey real, real estate. That's like the beachfront property. So you want to put as much merchandise. But where do I put those? I have doormats at my shop. I'll show you how I do okay. it. Okay. But we're going to take those off and we're going to put some shelving up there and we're going to maximize that space because that is not the best use of space right there. And this is just getting started, but we're gonna do these beautiful cushions, which I'm obsessed with. Um, these are these are $59.95, but they're are, hand tufted on the edge, so they're the French mattress. I these in a lot. You don't, 
Like that's a good price for those. I see these for 150. Okay, so yeah. she sees these for 150, but I bought them because I want them for the farmhouse, and they have the little tuft that matches my couch. Yeah, and you have the, these gorgeous mirrors, like this mirror could go up here with a wreath on top. We of sell it. a lot of mirrors. We ship yeah. a lot. Chris, Christy's really good at shipping mirrors. She doesn't oh. like to, but she does ship. Them. And this frame is insane. How much so that is well, that one's antique. That one's 99.95. That is totally gorgeous. And then this piece. Have they seen this? Yeah, do you guys do you guys remember when I did this piece on Waste Not Wednesday? I had to literally so Debbie, the <laughs> the big that. top was not dry. And so uh -huh. I had to get climb on top of the table. I'm yeah. sad because IOD doesn't make those transfers. I know, and that was one of my favorite ones. I think I have one or two left, and when I get home, I'm pulling one because that is gorgeous. Yeah, that cabinet giant is... roses are insanely beautiful, and this is only $150. We added the feet because it didn't have feet, and then I think we put a new back on it. It was falling apart, but yeah, that's from a waste on Wednesday. And it's so unique. Like, what was it? So I think it's from like an old camper. Oh, that's or a boat, which is why it has these latches, so that way when you're on water, it doesn't that, like. That is the coolest piece ever. So Abana good. says she remembers me getting up on the table. Like I'm on a live video, and I'm like, I am gonna get this transfer on, and I climbed on the table. Okay, in California, this would not be a hundred and fifty dollars. No, it would be so much more. It would be probably three hundred dollars, and that would be a good price. We'll send like, your I peeps over here to Utah. <laughs> It would be worth driving here to get that. All right, I want to show you guys this. This was from a Saturday night thrift haul. Do you guys remember this? So this I painted in skeleton key and white wax, and it turned out totally cute. And it's $18.95. It's metal wall decor. Look how cute that is. That is really cute. White wax is everything, Debbie. I, I, yeah, I think it's more of... Also, nobody's like bought these yet, and I'm wax. very sad. Well, they can't see them. They're hiding in there. The fork and spoon. You should do, so here's another thing that I think Jamie needs. She needs like two more Christmas trees and you need like a kitchen Christmas tree. You know what I need is a husband. The one who's doing the plumbing right now. He doesn't even come to the shop. He comes here to film two hours a week and that's it. Well, he's this kind week, of building a house. He's kind of busy. Yeah. So I got, I got myself. Yeah. I'm not used to doing things but myself. These, these are so pretty, but they need to be up at eye level. All right. Well, somebody's going to buy the tiki fork and spoon. Also, you guys, I forgot to display these. We have these skull beads. They're $12.95 with free shipping. Oops, I dropped one. There, so look, each strand is $12.95. Look how cool those are. Now. Girls, Debbie did her nails. Did you do your nails, Deb? I did. Do they notice how bad my nails usually look? I don't know. They just you know what else? Them. You could take a bracket. Like, I can't help it. You could take a bracket and then you could mount this on top and then you could hang all of your jewelry from these little teeth right here and have, have it hanging on the wall as a jewelry display. I'm always looking for ways to display my jewelry in a pretty way, because if I don't see it, if I tuck it in a drawer, then I forget about it, I never wear it. I wear one necklace till it breaks and I get another one. Oh, no, no, no. Yeah, this would be- I was like, I actually left my rooster <laughs> necklace at home. I have a rooster that I normally wear. And I think we showed him all this stuff in here. It's gonna get better, because Debbie's gonna keep playing in here. All right, let's go to the product room. Now, Debbie was obsessed with these, hold on just pay me with craft supplies but they were displayed over there look i put them there you think that's better mm, maybe maybe what okay so what do you do with these you just hang them in your craft room i love it i love the banner yes so cute so cute like you could just put a little string and hang them in your window yeah but i love cute. that yeah you they can remind me of we actually have some big christmas canvas banners that we don't have on display yet that i just got last week and they're huge like that with grommets and they're really cute what do they say Noel, family, uh, something or other. I'm right. going to get down in that basement and pull out more Christmas stuff. I love this. I, I have this stencil, but I never ordered the little... This is the accessory pack. Yeah, I need to. And this is the... I think I think this is the balusters. Yeah, very cute. Yeah, well, that one's fun. All right, so everything that's in this room, except for that scissor craft supply situation, this is all at jamierayvintage.com. I'm so shocked you have something painted bright. I paint bright stuff. That's blue iris, baby. I know what color it is. I'm I have old 57 candlesticks. I am a renaissance woman. Old 57 woman. is not bright. Old 57 <laughs> is way bright. No, it's a neutral. So also guys, if you go to jamierayvintage.com, we have the new floor, what are they called? The new IOD ones, what are they called? What? What's the new transfer called? Uh. Floral. No. Painterly floral. Oh, painterly floral is yes. on the website. Oh, here's all your 
hardware. Oh, you want to show them the hardware? Okay, I'll, I'll stop here. Look. But go to jamierayvintage.com. We have all the new flat packs of Midnight Garden. I don't know, a few other ones. But anyways, yeah, for sure. Okay, Painterly moving on. Floral is the new, yeah. Painterly Floral, the new Painterly Floral. And we also still have the Christmas stamps. Yeah, those are all, so they're all $3.95 except for this one is $4.95, the big chunky butcher block one. So these are all at jrbhome.com. Love it. And then I love, this one's my favorite. This is on my kitchen cabinets at home. That is so pretty. So this is what happens, Debbie. What? I buy stuff because I want it, mm -hmm. and then I sell it in the store. That's what I do with the stuff in my store, too. Like, that's, that's I saw this top, I'm like, yeah, I need that. I need to own that, <laughs> and I need a tax write-off. <laughs> All right, there's some stuff hiding in the hall. We'll get to that later. Oh, I didn't even look back there. Yeah, Good. we got stuff yes. for days, Debs. All right, that's we're going to go to the back room. Kids down there. <laughs> All right. Okay. Oh, Clothing we room. We can find out how much the jackets are. Oh, yeah, the jackets are $39.95. So good. Look at the one with the um, yep. leopard. Zeb oh, tried no. this one on. This one's $41.95. Zeb tried that on last week, and we sold out all of, almost all of them, but we restocked the sizes that I could get. Nice. How much is the silver tarnish bowl for $10.95? Is that in the Saturday Thrift Hall? I'll find that for you. I think it's in the back room. Is that okay. the Saturday Thrift Hall collection? I noticed this because I also sold this. I sold out of it and couldn't find any more. But I love this. I own one of these. Do you have and it in the gray, too? And it sold so fast. Yeah, I, I only reordered. got it in the gray. I can't find it anymore. Oh. Well, I, I tried. Some. Yeah, you Yeah, so them. this one is... She ordered them before I could. Thirty six ninety five. This is such a cute sweater. And you can put a tank top underneath. You know what I like I about mine. it? Is it hides the COVID cookies. Yes. If you have a few extra COVID pounds, it's good. And you've got this cute little lace-up detail on the back. Yeah, this was like, this went so fast in my store. All right, you guys want to see what Sheila's wearing? We got a new Be Kind shirt. Oh, that's Sheila? That's Sheila. My oh, I know my tag's in an armpit. This, this tag doesn't have a price on it. I'm actually going to take it off because it's hot. I'm starting to sweat. I'll put it on. I'm cold. All right. You're cold. I'm hot. There you go. All right. So Sheila's wearing our new Be Kind shirt. This, so we have it in this color as well as, I think it's like a dark gray. I like those flowy pants. Ooh, Jamie, you got it all toasty warm for me. So Ooh, these are really our comfy. Palazzo pants. Guess how much they are. Just guess. Well, now I know your pricing. I'm going to say that they're like $12.95. They're $18.95. Okay. Yeah, and they come in plus sizes, and they come in a few different those colors. Those are cute. My sister loves to wear those kinds. The Palazzo pants? Yeah. Why is I, she named Sheila? Well, so I got her secondhand, uh -huh. and when I bought her, the lady told me her name was Sheila, and I didn't feel like I could rename her. You know that song? No, I don't. Oh, Sheila. It's probably before my time. Oh, 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 Sheila. It's Prince. Prince of the Revolution. Sheila. Da, he had da, a band? Da. I thought he was always by himself. No, he started off with the two girls, the oh. two backup singers. That was a long time ago, friend. Yeah. All right, so <laughs> Be Kind also comes in they gray. They probably know. And Sheila's wearing... Let me know in the know comments if you is. know the song. But yeah, I love the Be Kind this way. So we have we have the shirt that said Be Kind this way, but I liked that one. Uh, yeah, and then we've got the Mary unique. and the Burgundy and the Red just came in. It's very high-end looking that very way. Very chic. Yes. All right. Oh, look at your cute little table down there. My what table? That table is well, cute. It's cute, but we had to lift the mannequin. I know. So I'm going to steal that and re-merchandise it somewhere else. You're going to re-merchandise it? All right, let's talk oh, about wait, joggers. Wait, I want to talk about this top because I, I saw this and I, I actually want Okay, that's myself. little girl sizes. But it's so cute. Eliza has that top. I love it. I could. I This is the extra large. I think I might be able to fit into it. It's cute. Well, for $16.95. And I like the fabric. Did you know that all my clothes like have free shipping? No. Yeah, all of them are free shipping. No JRB closet, all free shipping. I, so those bags I got reminded me of you. Which one? But nobody's bought them yet. These? The boho bag. Yeah. I have a bag that's very similar to this. Well, does it have the big giant pom-pom? It does. $59.95 for this bag. That's so cute. I tried a little boho. I can do color in bags. I'm proud of you, Jamie. And then we've got, so Sheila's also donning. Let me show you guys. Our only real leather purse. This one is eighty nine ninety five, and that's that genuine leather, and it comes with it comes in a bag, Debbie. It's a bag that a comes, bag for your bag. It has a bag for your you bag. You know it's fancy when it when your bag has it's a bougie. bag. Very it's bougie. bougie. Yeah. So we've got that. We we have all prices here because we have the the fake. We have vegan leather, which is isn't that the word for 
bougie leather. This is really pink. cute too. This is adorable with these little pom pom. Like, look at the texture. The Swiss on dot. That. Yes, I love this. So this is the woven pom pom top. At the top is twenty nine ninety five. Put like a like a black tank top or a neutral tank top. Or underneath. nothing if you want to be sexy. No. Look at the back detail too and the little And she's just sleeves. ignoring me. I would totally wear this. I love this top. Does this look like me to you guys? It's blush. It's not bright. Yeah, but it's it's the like it's the sleeve the detail and the texture and the feel of the fabric. It's like totally I'm into So Christy it. actually ordered those. Oh, Christy. She loves that. So this is my vegan leather bag. Cute. The boho bag. And it comes with a little bag inside of it. And because it's vegan leather, it's only $31.95 for this big bag. All right, what else? That's the small section. So I know. Debbie, why don't you shop and tell them what things you like? And I will go find some joggers because I know they're dying to see which new joggers we got. Okay. I really like this top too. Look, it's got like the little peekaboo situation right here. And it's the same kind of drapey fabric. The, is, like, look, it's very similar to the top I'm wearing. It feels like it's probably cotton. And it's got nice bell sleeves. It goes all the way around in the back. I would say that this would be something that's really... Oh my gosh, your prices are... We got new price tags. So this one is, th I think it's $36.95. $36.95. Totally, totally worth it. At Anthropology, this would be a $60 top. Well, this what is else? Anthro Jamie Ray. All right, while she's doing that, all of our joggers are $19.95 with free shipping. Look at these new ones that just came in. Debbie, tell them how soft these are. Have you at oh. least worn the Day of the Dead joggers I got I you? I haven't. I, I'm waiting for the special. For the right time for the Day of the Dead? <laughs> yes. Jamie, like seriously. So these are $19.95. These come in sizes all the way from small up to 3X for these joggers. Okay, this top is so cute. Look so it. I have Buttons to tell you, up. this does size small. You got to size up in these. And then you got this lace in the back and it it's like a cotton, it's like a cardigan. So you could totally wear this with something else underneath. That is beautiful. Donna has five pairs of joggers. All right, if you love music, we also got these joggers in. Oh. Joggers are the new leggings. And these have pockets and cups. They are super soft. They're buttery soft. They are well, very are. soft. So this is plus size. Do you only. guys say leggings or leggings? I always- Leggings. Leggings? Well, that's a Utah thing, a mountain. A legging. I always thought they were leggings. Well, they probably are leggings, but <laughs> but leggings is so. And we much restocked fun. some of our other plus size joggers that went out of stock. So oh, look, the same top in black. You can tell Dude. Debbie's not into the joggers, but all my comfy peeps, where are you at? Christmas is calling. No, I I am into the joggers, but I don't know. Like nobody, joggers are our number. Nobody one sees seller. you when you're in your joggers, so I nobody wonder what's you the point. It's COVID, man. This is cute. This has got pockets. Super cute. That one's really soft. This is like wearing pajamas, but you can actually wear it out on the town. So do you know what we call dresses like that? The all-you-can-eat dress. No, we call them crotchless <laughs> yoga pants. Because <laughs> there's no crotch in them, it's and so they're just like wearing fall. yoga pants. Cute. This is, I have this one. This is one of my favorite little cardigans. Oh, I've seen you wear that. But this is actually, though. so this I wore in my family pictures. Okay, I love this. Look at this. This is very cute. It's like a sweatshirt, but it's not. It's fancy with the sleeves and it's super soft, just as soft as the joggers. I like soft clothes. You're, you can yeah. pretty much like this, this Be Kind shirt. This one's really soft too. Yeah, your, your clothes are soft. I like, look, this is kind of a boho top. It's actually called the boho top. The boho top? Yeah. Cute. This one I haven't showed a lot. This Ooh. is a this oh, is that cute. is one of our best sellers. Comes in blue and gray. That is cute. It looks like an IOD transfer right here. And then it's what I love. You should want to match your furniture. I love like the little transfer. detailing right here. And then look, the banded sleeve. It's like, it's a t-shirt, but it's fancy. I love that. I love looking like like i'm cute but i didn't try very hard to look cute i just woke up this way i just That's, love this is this. that you're way more excited than zeb because he is not this excited oh the gray oh, no. with the floral I, so this one in gray is 29.95 that is really good i like i really like that it, this, this one's actually really flattering on too yeah it looks like it would be so and this one is a small but they're really generously yeah, they're, sized yeah it looks very generously sized so i wear a small in this one and i still have room for like a piece of cake maybe yeah. a burrito so cute yeah i have some fun stuff and like it's stuff. it's like it's not too busy so you could actually wear it with the joggers oh for sure you could wear yeah. it well 
they uh, we have some black ones but they're only in plus size but you could wear them with some black floral ones black floral joggers mm -hmm. would be cute with this yes. or some leggings i think that's my favorite top that's your favorite top out of so all far. these tops yeah like what so all right i love this sweatshirt but christy doesn't like it because she doesn't like the fur <laughs> i think this sweatshirt is so dang cute i like it it's, a, it's, it's an unexpected situation at the wrist look like when you're when, when you're, you're cold. feeling when you're feeling stressed, you can just rub it next <laughs> yeah. to your face because it's all soft and it's got embroidered flowers yeah. on the top. It's very cute. Nineteen ninety five with free shipping. It's cute. I got it on clearance. And this is also cute, Jamie. This little top. I love the fabric. Oh yeah, that one's fun. That's a really nice fabric, and it's got the little gathering in the back, so it's flowy and cute. And the it feels like a woven cotton, but maybe it's a blend. It's probably little a blend. Tassels. It doesn't, I, this is like the one shirt that I have that's 100% cotton is this one. Look how wrinkled it is because I haven't got the steamer out. It's $18.95. French, know. it's a French gauze shirt. It really should be like 50 bucks because it's a French gauze shirt. But no. I got it on clearance. So look, these, these are cotton. No, they're, I think they're a cotton blend. No, it looks like cotton. The, one, the top like, I'm wearing is all cotton. It's the same exact fabric. I don't know what this. What does this say? Oh, it is 100% cotton. Yep, I know. You're right. I know my cotton. Debbie it doesn't knows have her fabs. Be, it doesn't have to be super wrinkly. Well, that one's wrinkly on purpose. I love this sweater because it's soft. That is. This soft. one is 32.95. This is leopard cardigan. Very cute. Yeah, we have some. This dress is really flattering on too. I've seen you in that. that yeah, one's that one's a good cute. one. It hides all the COVID cookies. <laughs> Can you tell that I have a theme going with the coat? Cookie? Yeah, and this is a super cute sweater for fall. I love the long cardigans with the. We have a few cable. of those left in olive and rust. Look at this. This is cute. It's got pockets. You put on your jeggings and your little sassy T-shirt, and then you throw this over it with some Done. boots. You're like ready for fall. I didn't think I could wear that color, and it actually looks really good on brunettes. All right, Debbie, let's take you over here. All right, so these we've well, I don't know we've got leggings galore. Um, these are our jean section, so we have plus size and regular jeans. These ones are really good. Those are my favorite. Oh, those those are ones are cute. cute. So these, what are these ones called? These are these are winter jeans because they don't have holes in the knees. These are the dark wash skinny jeans, twenty six ninety five. Such a good price. I told them I'm a good shopper. Oh, look at the um the cow. donkey serape shirt. The cow. Yeah, it's not a cow. Donkey. It's a donkey. I don't, I, I don't know my farm animals. I'm sorry. The donkey. I think that's the last one From that we Baja. have. That is cute. That one is one of my favorites. Let's see. I was I was holding up something that I got at Kobe's and I said it was a chicken, but it was a hen. Or I didn't know that there was like. Sally, if you're buying just clothes and it's charging you shipping, email info at jamierayvintagehome.com and let Caitlin know which item it is because sometimes... Oh, Caitlin fixed it already. All right, Sally, go back. What are man socks, Jamie? Strong enough for a man but made for a woman. Otherwise known as they probably were made someplace that doesn't understand the difference between men and women. $5.95 for both pairs, though. They're really comfortable. But why, why man socks? I don't. Get I, I didn't name them, but they're they say health socks, so they make you healthier. Okay. I don't. I don't make the things. I don't. I don't know the names. Got lots of joggers. Oh, I have these joggers. You have those joggers too? Yes. Look, those these. are the only joggers I have that aren't like super soft. And these are the ones that I chose to take home and wear. <laughs> Not funny. Yeah, they're not as soft as the other ones, but and they come in the a small, fabric. medium, and a large, extra the large. The fabric is so pretty. I love those colors. Yeah, they're really yeah. fun. There's a lot of really great. Well, Debbie owns these ones, and she hasn't worn them yet. I was like, look, they're loud, and they're Day of the Dead. This says Debbie all over it. You're saying I'm loud? Well, you like loud colors. You're actually quiet. But I'm. I don't feel like I'm loud. I just feel like I'm. But you like bright stuff. Well, so does Dion, but Dion's not loud. I feel but like her I'm colors are loud. I loud would, is not like I a bad thing. No, I would say bright, okay, saturated. It's saturated. These are saturated. saturated Nobody wants saturated drawers. <laughs> <laughs> That's another problem entirely. <laughs> these are very cute. I'm going to wear these. I'm going to wear these soon. They are soon. super soft. Do you have XL in the jacket that Debbie has on? I don't know because I just got them in, but let me see. Yes, we do have XL because I'm looking at it right now. I'm loving all your jewelry over here. 
and it. I Kayla said she was thinking the same thing. What about the saturated drawers? <laughs> You love my jewelry. I was thinking, yeah. Debbie, do you like my jewelry display? I did do this myself. I love this display. I just want to put it more at eye level. So I need to like raise this up maybe? Or put it on this shelf and then move these move down. Move the pajama pants yeah. down. And these are super cool too. You gave me one of these. Yeah, the cups. I love. Have you guys seen these hats? We just got them in. They're $14.95 and they have the crisscross so you can have your ponytail up higher. And they're adjustable, which is pretty great. And they're kind of distressed. They come in camo blue and gray and I was thinking these would be really fun to stencil on so or if you want to you know you can decoupage on hats or you can decoupage yes it's a thing yeah. all right Mary so did those. one and she showed it to me it looks really cool these are um, cute these are the little jewelry pouches they're 295 so you can like make jewelry and then put them in these little pouches I love Utah. wow that's so cute 9.95 with free shipping for I love Utah and this little leaf the little abalone, the abalone leaf that is so pretty that is gorge. We have some cute stuff. I have little jewelry because I, I don't wear a lot of big jewelry. Is this for your like keychain? Yeah, it's just a brass keychain. I need to get something to go with them, but I haven't gotten that far. I think they're awesome. You know what I love? The way, because I I don't know where to put all my back stock of shoes and it's taken up Oh, you up like our, my display? It's taken up our whole back stock room. Guess what's behind so these? this was genius. Ta-da, they're shoes, but this is not all of our shoes. The rest yeah. of my studio. Shoes take up so much space. They do take up a lot of space. Have you, did you like my shoe display? I actually tried to channel you. Yes. A little bit. I, I mean, do. it's not as great as probably, you could probably fix it a little, but this is my shoe display here at the shop. And we had a piece of furniture that wasn't selling. So I took it out and I put the ladder on and we put the Christmas lights in. It's cute. So, Jamie, it's very cute. Shoes. And look, these shoes are only $26.95. Those are good. I clearly like them. I like these here. With the French, those are also yeah. $26.95. Look, okay. I knew you'd like the French. They're like go-go shoes. They didn't They're know you go -go. could decoupage. You guys, I will decoupage clothes for you. I didn't know I didn't tell you, you that. You can decoupage shoes, shoes and hats. Probably not a t-shirt. Well, no, because maybe... you don't want it to put through the washing machine. No. But you can use the liquid patina that DIY liquid patina and you it's can decoupage. It's the secret sauce. It is the secret sauce. A lot All of right. people don't realize what liquid patina can do. Can do a I'm lot just of making stuff. sure I haven't missed anything. What's this one's name? We haven't named this one. What should we name her? Prince. 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 Go with Sheila. And the Prince and Sheila. <laughs> <laughs> this is our mannequin. Her name is Prince. <laughs> there you go. Or a Purple Rain. I don't know. Purple. <laughs> Have you seen our American? You do know that song, truck? right? You know yeah. the Purple Rain song. Yes, right? I know Purple Rain, but I just knew what it was songs Prince. were were popular when you were a kid. Um. I don't know. I don't really know music. Okay. Like, I don't. I could probably sing them for you, but nobody wants to hear that. Baby Got Back. <laughs> That's not appropriate. Um, <laughs> what else? There's, oh, California Love. California Love. That one song by that rapper. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> by Ice Cube. No, don't you know You don't it. speak Ice Cube? Mm. I know I've heard of them. Oh, okay. Well, anyways. All right, there is our shop tour. You can pick up everything you saw at jrvhome.com, except for the paint. Um, the paint and the IOD and the stencils are at jamierevintage.com. This is very soft. It's very bougie. I feel so um, Kardashian. Kardashian. I don't know. Is don't that a good thing? Well, I don't know. I don't have a television, so I just know that they're popular and they wear bougie things. Bougie things. <laughs> it's fake bougie. You may it's Oh, good. Debbie made me buy the black jacket. Yumiko bought it because you have it on. Oh, Yumiko, I, you got to post a picture in on social media of you wearing this jacket. Yeah, be like, look, yeah. I got it. It's right. so soft. You're going to love it. It's very, like, I don't like jackets that make you feel like, you know, like you can't. Well, you just got to buy a this. bigger size. No, but some of the fabric doesn't <laughs> bend with you, even if it is right size. But I like I like a jacket to feel not like a jacket. When I put on jackets and I feel like I'm too, it's too stiff. I just buy a bigger size. Rustly. I, I like no. I like loose clothes. My t-shirts, my jeans. I like the bottoms to be tight and the tops to be loose. I got to the farmhouse today and I'm like, Debbie, you're gonna have to change your shoes. Yeah. Because she helped me at the farmhouse. Was, it's gonna be in our next video. I was helping her with the floor. I let her use the. I use the nail. I gun. let her use the nail gun. <laughs> It's, it's, she's really good. <laughs> no. But I did wood putty all the You the were super good at the wood putty. Yes. She did awesome. All right, guys. We love you. Thanks for joining us. Hit up JRV Home and JamieRayVintage.com. And we'll see you later. Bye. Bye. Let me see if I, Zeb always does this, so I don't know.
Or do you push the end button? Oh, the X. 